Hi YouTube, Plice here. And today I have a I have a gun to do a speed paint. I like a speed paint, more like a speed drawing. I got these new marker. I got these new yesterday. Yesterday at school, we went to Target as a for school field trip for Christmas to buy us our own presents and go to McDonald's. And I'm pretty lucky for that. And we got a hundred color pencil kits for myself. This is this is amazing. I just had to get a hundred color pencils. Like I got it myself. I bought my a lot of the money that the teacher gave me, but it was awesome. With that, with those color pencils, they put them in this box over here. Our supplies. So with this box, I'm gonna be drawing my avatar, Cool Ice. And Cool Ice, um, I got I have many different versions of her. One with black hair and a ponytail and a blue sweater. One with the white hair in the black and black and blue dress. Another one with um, a black a black sweater and white pants with the blue cat ear hair. So I can do a whole new avatar, a whole new one. I think it'll suit my character much better than the ones I chose before. Let's start with it. So I'm going to be copying my face a little bit because my face is kind of chubby. If you didn't know that, my face is kind of chubby. Some of, you, some of you have seen my face, some of you haven't. Be just kind of chubby and just draw the character first. My pencil already broke, right? So you can't, so you can't see what I'm doing. I don't have a good camera to do a good angle of the drawing. Let me see if I can do it from the side view. Too close. Let's try another view. Hang on, let me just fix the camera. Good, okay, you guys can see what I'm doing from this angle, so you guys can see what I'm going to draw. I'm going to draw my avatar with my new sketch pad and stuff. I can't get cool eyes. My real name, I'm not going to review my real name yet. Not until I'm real, not until I'm old enough for you to, so I won't need child protection stuff. Because I'm 14 years old. So I'm going to draw a nose. So my nose is kind of like a mixture of like a long bridge with like an African American nose. But they all have, everyone has like a specific type of nose. African Americans have like a specific type of nose shape, so I'm gonna do that, but with a bridge on top. Draw my chubby cheek, draw my chubby face. Here's my face. I'm not gonna draw the cat ears. After I drew the eyes, I gotta draw the eyes. Now I'm going to draw my cat ears, fix the camera view. So now I, I have poofy curly hair, like a cape. I have really curly poofy hair. I'm trying to make my, my character look as realistic as possible. I have to give myself some bangs so my face look more fuller, more nicer. Pretty much my face is really chubby. I've, I've, my chest is kind of big for my age because I'm, I'm 14 but I have like a C cup. So I'm going to have kind of a big chest. I have, really, I have a really wide hips too, like a really big butt which is funny. I'm 14, I look like this, and I'm short too, so it's really funny. So like my mom, skinny like my dad, but I have the big, uh, certain big in certain areas. I have fat in certain areas, and um, skinny in certain areas. I think it looks really funny. I have really big thighs. I have really thick ankles, and I have really big feet, so I can draw my feet kind of big. Too small, hang on. There's a specific pose. My favorite animals are not cats, actually. My favorite animals are snails. I like snails. They were always so cute, and I don't know why I like snails. And usually people don't say them as cute, but I really do. I don't know why I always like snails. <laughs> it was hard to find a snail plushie as a sidekick. 
Crash against Nails and Sidekick. That's what I want. I, like, like um, certain YouTubers have a little add a stuffed animal sidekick. I want one, and mine's gonna be a snail. It's gotta find a blue snail somewhere. I haven't already have a snail. I already have a snail, but it's pink. Her name's Snelly. Gonna get a blue one. Fix this hand a little bit. Map of that character is my. Shocking, my blue is my favorite color. My favorite color is actually red. But the reason I use blue is because my name is Cool Ice, and blue is in, red doesn't really match with ice. I like your red and blue, but I don't really like those colors together. You look good, but not really for a girl. If you were, if you're going to wear blue and red, good for you, but not for me. I'm not really a girly person. You like to wear shorts. I like to wear pants and shorts, and not not really like to wear shorts. But I like to wear pants. I would wear like a loose fitting top, but I like to be snuggly. I wear sweaters and pants and stuff, or a t-shirt maybe, depending on what I'm wearing over it. Maybe a sweater over it. This is like my special outfit for my avatar. Gonna do something really cute. Off the shoulder. Like a little bit torn, like I'm just keep I'm a cat, so let's just make little stripes. Ripped torn um, pants at the bottom. Low riding jeans to the belt. I like to wear boots. It's my favorite thing to wear boots. Long sleeve top with stripes on it. Give myself a poofy curly tail to remember that I'm a cat. See, my favorite thing to do is draw. I do that a lot, and I like to draw digitally better, but this is nice too. It relaxes me more than digital art. To get like little details into pictures that I can't with digital art. I think this one gives me big details better, but the regular pencil, I can actually take my time with it and not, like, get frustrated with the erasing. The only problem I have to do with, with regular uh, traditional art is with the color. Traditional art, you have to work, work with the colors. Here's my avatar's outfit. It might not look like much right now, but we're going to outline it with color it. And stuff. I like my hair to be white and blue. It's one of my favorite colors, white and blue. So I only get an absolute zero blue for a certain color if I can find it. This is the color we're gonna use. We're gonna use um a sky blue mixed with absolute zero blue if I can find it. Sky blue. So this is the color we're gonna use. Absolute zero. And sky, don't look, they look exactly the same, but they're pretty much different, trust me. You just test out the colors on another piece of sheet of paper, as you see. Just test out the colors. Good. And good. Here you have the please. <coughs> I want video I do, I wish sneeze in it. I'm gonna like little outlines on the, on the side with the, the blue. Make sure you get all those... Make sure you don't do the whole hair blue because you're gonna make it a little bit like platinum colored. That's what blue highlights that we're trying to do for. You know, like do like a little bit of like a frosty tone to the bottom with the blue. And with the tips of the hair too. Let's see, so this blue is a sky blue. I have hot glue over it because I use it for the hot glue gun. I'm trying to measure out my character's um, popsicle bodies. So, as well as using a spice covered in hot glue. I don't know if you can see it, but my pencil is covered in hot glue. Now for the hair. Now for the absolute zero. It's a lighter color, lighter shade. Lighter shade blue. We're going to do a little bit more on the outside. So it's kind of blue and kind of white and kind of in between. See, there we go. Now I'm going to do the same thing for the tail, except with just absolute zero blue. Unless I feel like using the other blue too, but it depends on how it's going to turn out. Sorry, I don't know that one. Shut up, Alpha.
So there we go. My do, do blue eyes. My eyes are not blue, but let's just say it is because the character's eyes are blue. There we go. Now we're going to um, get the black pencil. Let me sharpen a little bit my pencil sharpener. Find my pencil sharpener. This is my electric one. If I can get out from under the bed. Hang on. Ugh. It's stuck under the bed. There we go. Make sure it's like a tip. The tip is sharp enough. The tip is like really pointed. The tip is really pointed so we can like get the little details in there. To outline the character. So let's just keep going. Outline my eyes a little bit. So I can do um outline the face structure. Outline the skin. Outline the must be a head a later after I color in my skin. My skin's kind of a Spanish color, so let's just find that color of his tan a little bit. Now khaki and no. Copper and no. Let me see what copper looks like. Okay, so that's the like, copper skin tone. The skin's kind of dark, not this dark, but like dark and like similar to this. My character's not gonna wear makeup, she's not really a makeup person. But most of my characters might wear makeup, but my character's not really a makeup person. There we go. There's her skin tone. So I finished the rest of the outfit. My outfit is going to have like a, like a black shirt. That's not a black. Um, a blue shirt. It's going to... The shirt's color is going to be, um, let's see. A true blue. We're going to get a true blue and a sky blue. Here's true blue. So true blue is going to be the outline. So we're going to outline it with true. True blue around the breast area and around the sides, not really the middle, but more of the sides. Be cautious of how you're coloring it in. Then we're gonna get a sky blue and like color in the little the edges that we didn't color in with this true blue so it sticks out more. Color my stomach with copper. Push. Okay, then I'm gonna outline my arms and, and hands. Now we're going to go down here for the pants, the jeans I'm wearing. They're going to be white, like my avatars, like my avatars pants. So I get absolute zero blue and go and outline it. Not really like color it in, but like slightly color it in on around the sides to make sure it's like three-dimensional looking. There we go. Then I color the rest of my legs. Um... The copper color. Make sure it's more like a like an ombre thing. Like you go in dark and come out light slowly. A little bit more faster than slowly, like medium speed. Then I'm gonna do my boots. My boots are gonna be like like they have like a little ball at the bottom. I didn't do that. 
add a little extra touch I might do. Oh, right, if you notice, um, my name's Cool Life, but I do not like the cold at all. I hate the folding weather. I hate winter. I hate everything cold. So I like to be warm a lot. Despite my name, I like to be warm. I hate the cold. I'm not Elsa. Plus, I hate Elsa. I don't like the Frozen. If you're going to yell at me for not liking Frozen, think about what the movie's about. It might be emotional at times, but then we have scenes that... You don't know who the villain is till the end of the movie. Uh, it's mostly about just tr this an adventure trying to find her sister. And when we do find her sister, we have to find a way to free the person. Like, I have more problems than one. Usually in a movie, we have, like, one problem, and they work together to fix it, like in Aladdin. Aladdin is a good movie. Like, you have one problem, and one little side problem, but the problem doesn't become so big that the problem is too much. That's why I don't like Frozen, because the Frozen plotline is, like, so wacky. It's like... You get it. You get it. She's she's Anna, and she has a sister that isolated her. Sad. It's relatable, but it's just to the point where it's like, is this a sad excuse for a sister story? I'm just saying. I'm sorry. This is, it's not good for me. It's like not really a fun movie. to. It's fun to watch, but it's not when you want to be serious. You know what I'm saying? Watch the movie again tell, and compare it to other Disney movies and tell me how good it is. Just do that. Don't yell at me for liking to not liking Frozen. If you're honest, it says, if you don't yell at me for not liking it. Might be that if only girl in the world doesn't like Frozen, but just just forget it. I just don't like it. That's because of the girl that's that's has nice powers and uh, and uh, and it's like funny at times. Doesn't mean I like it. Doesn't mean it's a good story. Might have some funny elements. Might have some good elements in it, but doesn't mean the whole thing is good. Okay, so let me just sign the character's name. And there she is, Cool Ice. Here's Cool Ice, here's a picture of her. I finished it. So you hope you enjoyed this video. Please comment, subscribe if you enjoyed. Stay cool, stay freezing, peace out. Thank you.